Which is more important, doing the right thing or doing things right? This was your question last week, you guys answered, and I will be reading your answers in this video. But before we get started, we need a new question for this week. Your question for this week will be, would you rather be a hero or be a villain? Or there's a third option, neither. And make sure you tell me why as well. Leave your answers in the comments below and I will read them next week. Now, let's see whether you think doing the right thing or doing things right is more important. Before we actually take a look at your answers though, I have one thing I need to say. That is, this next week I will be working every single day. Only three hours from one to four, so it's not that big of a deal. But because of this, I will not be streaming. I will have videos up and ready to go on those days so that you have something to watch. But there will be no live streams again because I am working, so I apologize for that. Not much I can do really about that. There will be another time in August, I believe it is the week of the 20th in August, that this will be the exact same situation. I will not be able to livestream that week, and I will have videos ready for you to go. So that's just so that you guys know. Now let's see your answers. Croco says doing things right. T Lisa says doing the right thing as well as possible. Zincat says I think everyone is ultimately alone in themselves or there are many other people around. You never know if you're truly connected with others. I believe that was in response to the previous question. Caesar says I think doing things right by you is my answer. I've learned no matter how right you try to do things, there always seems to be someone who says you've messed up. Very true. As well is doing the right thing for someone that has the same results as I mentioned early there is usually someone who doesn't think you did the right thing absolutely so learned self-appreciation and learning to do things right by you is what I'd go for even though I know that in and of itself might sound wrong to some unfortunately that is true and also thank you Caesar for replying about the uh, subscriber count idea because I actually just forgot about it until I saw your comment haha <laughs> which means that this week as far as I know right now at the time of recording this I have 510 subscribers so thank you all so much we are over 500. I'm still gonna wait just a little bit longer before I do the uh, th thank you video regarding this So I apologize for that, but it's coming soon Gotta think of something special to do for it as well My mom says to do the right thing to do things right would be good But if you're not doing the right thing at the time It doesn't matter if you do it right if it's not the right thing to do. Am I making any sense here? Absolutely you are. Why is the wizard says both? Matchot has a long one for us um, the, Saying that these are two separate things meaning doing things right would mean you're doing something wrong morally etc or vice versa Versa. Me personally, I'd much rather be judged over doing something wrong than be judged by being someone not morally right, which would be doing the right thing. I don't care to a point what people think of me when I'm not around, but I care about my integrity and character and how Christ, as I'm a Christian, doesn't mean I'm perfect by the way, calls me to act. I do mess up and I'm always happy when others call it out when I do in order to better myself. And Benny says, I think doing the right thing because it often helps a humanity like charity and things and so on. So this one was certainly an interesting question. This one's kind of like a, a question of morality because just because you're doing something right doesn't necessarily mean that it's the right thing to do. You know, I mean, for example, just just a random example, because I'm trying to think of something off the top of my head here. Uh, if you are trying to build some kind of a weapon, for example, well, you might know how to do it the right way. You might build it right. But is it the right thing to do to build that weapon? You know, because weapons are dangerous and they cause harm. So causing harm, is that the right thing to be doing? Probably not unless it's a question of self-defense or survival or something along those lines now personally I would also much rather do the right thing rather than doing things right for the exact reason that I just mentioned or sp Other specific examples of it. However, I will in in everything that I do I always try to do it the right way, but just because I've done something correctly or well doesn't mean that it was okay to do it. But either way, that concludes this video and all of your answers, so thank you all so much for your participation. I always enjoy these questions like this that make you think, so don't forget your question for next week, which again is, would you rather be a hero, be a villain, or neither? I'm kind of only putting neither there as an option because I know some people don't want to be either, so. This way we don't have people asking, can I choose neither? Am I forced to choose one or the other? How about how, how about as a little bit of a bonus, maybe, if, if you guys think about it or care about it or whatever, um, pretend that you have only the two choices, hero or villain. Make it more interesting that way. Leave your answers in the comments below and I'll read them next week. Now, of course, to end off with Humble Bundle this week, there is a really, really cool program and you only have to pay a minimum of $1 in order to get it. Uh, and that is called VoiceBot. Now, VoiceBot, of course, it will tell you that it is for gamers, for games. But let me be clear about this. 
it is not only for games. You can use it for your computer itself and you can use it for literally any program. Basically what it allows you to do is allows you to use a microphone, so you use your voice to do certain actions on your computer and you can set these actions. You can choose exactly what you want these actions to be. So you, so you can set macros and what that means is you can literally say one single word and cause 50 different actions to happen on your computer. You can even make specific profiles that are for specific programs so that they only work if that program is open and currently being used. So it's really, really cool. I got it myself. It's really interesting. I like it so far. It's, it's a little bit weird because, of course, if you talk fast and you're not talking clearly, which when it comes to gaming and especially streaming while gaming, sometimes it just won't hear it properly because I'm talking too fast or I'm saying multiple words in succession which then it takes as one thing rather than that word itself, if that makes sense. But if you're not doing that kind of thing and it's just something you kind of want to try out, again, you can literally pay $1. Originally, it's $16. And I know I'm spending a lot of time talking about this one, but this one to me is really, really cool. I'm going to make a specific dedicated video regarding this one uh, before 10 days are up because there's only 10 days left in order to get this thing from Humble Bundle. Again, link is up there and also over here. Uh, clicking on the link or in the description will help support me as well as charity so please go check it out it's really really cool they have of course some other stuff in this bundle as well and yeah that's about it so thank you so much for watching don't forget your question hero villain neither leave answers comments and I'll see you next week bye bye god bless